my name is Maya, and my mom is behind the camera. Hello. Hi, now mommy is uh, here too. <laughs> and, uh, welcome back to our garden again. Yay! And also, we moved to our new house. Yes. Uh, today I've uh, trimmed my uh, bougainvillea. And I have Book a lot via. book and via. <laughs> uh, so we're going to, I'll, I'll try to propagate it. I watched the video. I'm not an expert. That's going to be my first time. And I'm going to... These are corn pit. Yes, I uh, said because you're not seeing here. We're going to use the, um, this cup for two reasons. I like how sturdy they are. They are like really wide and sturdy, convenient well, for, pla for pots. Are. We'll have several. And also, I like the fact, uh, I like the repurposing of things. Can I have it? So, yes. Uh, hold on. Okay. Uh, well, I, I just found out today, I got a genius idea to poke the holes with um, this tool. Corn. Corn tool. It's really easy to do that. Can I try? Okay, yes, you can try it with a different I wanna one. I want to do that one. Okay, so poke many holes. It sounds okay? cool. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's just poke holes. Um, oh, look, this one is harder. Oh, I that did one it! Is really easier. Yeah, be careful. Yeah, but it's still doable. Uh, or you can poke it with something else. Yeah, but I we're really going like to use these because these yeah. are pretty good and you can see they're sharp. <laughs> okay. I like to do this. And then, I do not have growing hormones, so I will try to do it without that, to propagate and uh, make my sticks rooting. So I'll use some sphagnum moss, which I like to root my uh, plants with it. I'll mix it with uh, a regular potting uh, dirt and uh, soil. And uh, yeah, we'll just do it without any additional things. Mike, can you show yours? I think she got a little bit carried away. <laughs> okay, we made some holes. So now Maya, let's fill them with sphagnum moss, a handful. Of sphagnum oh moss. My God. So I'll use some sphagnum moss and the rest of the soil. Okay, next step, yeah. we're putting some planting soil. I don't want to, mine is up here. Uh, and uh, and, and uh, we're going to like mix. I did it all that. So mix a little. Oh, I think that's enough. Yeah. So now let's mm. mix it. Well, I have a nice mixture here. Is this good? Uh, not really. You don't want to make your hands dirty, are you? No, I don't want to. Okay, so um, also uh, I want to say that sphagnum moss is not necessary. Uh, I just had it because we, ha we bought a bunch for our gecko's terrarium. So I'm using it and I like to use it, but it's not necessary. You can also use just planting soil. Yeah. Uh, also, oh, we have a really pretty bird's nest. Yeah, that's a pretty also, bird's nest. Also, I took it off and played with it with my bird. It's not a nest, it's a feeder. Yeah, they, they're beautiful finches come here. Speaking of nests and feeders, feeders, we have, we had... Okay, it's enough, sweetie. We had birds that were making a nest, but now, and we put this wooden board on, but now they're not coming back. Yeah, we were hoping that the doves would live there. Maybe they will come back still. We Hopefully. made a beautiful, uh, convenient place for their nest. So Maya, now we have dirt and what we're gonna, going to do, I, that's my bougainvillea I cut. It's sad now, but I'm really hoping for it to get better. And these are all the shrubs. I know, I cut them. So we will take the um, edges, like the tips, uh, for propagation, and we'll try to do that. Okay, now I'm going to follow the instructions of the professionals. Mm -hmm. So the stuff for propagation has to be already like a wood, woody stem from above. Woody. So we'll take the top of it and we'll take 
about like five eight inches that what what the guy like said right under that little spike and we need to remove the leaves so that it doesn't lose many uh, but we'll leave can many, I try oh, the next branch uh, uh, yes and we'll leave just a little bit for it to maybe uh, for photosynthesis but I think that's the stick we're going to use and we'll try it we're just learning if it um, gives roots and if it's viable I plant it I have uh, space to plant but I also try I will try others other colors I maybe ask for my from my neighbors for some uh, branches and I'll do it because I think it's fun I don't want to prick myself okay, like no 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 go higher okay just the tip Here. yeah okay and then the other edge here. Mm, maybe here okay and now remove the leaves we don't need this anymore thank you oh, okay. now take this middle part and remove the leaves uh, maybe leave it one the top leaf okay well then why did you leave half of this leaf uh, because it was too big this one is already like halved <laughs> <laughs> okay Three. Each of us has three seedlings and then we have a stick. We just uh, cut it off the shrubs. So Maya, go on and stick your seedlings uh, evenly uh, in the container. Yeah, like that. Yeah, this is the top, you're correct. And then we'll stick a stick. To make uh, a greenhouse. So, in the middle of it? No, somewhere in the corner. Uh, it will just be a holding construction for our greenhouse. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's and make sure they I don't want fall. A smaller stick. Uh, so you can cut it, Maya. If it's too long, I think it's too long. I'll go get this okay. plier. And then Plier's later, I will take a bag. And I will put the bag over it. Yes, and put it make, over it. make a little greenhouse. Yeah. So that it doesn't lose its moisture. So we're making a greenhouse here. No waste. The bags are also from some stuff from Amazon. What? So yeah, we're all covered. And I see. I think I don't even need. Um, I I prepared some rubber bands just in case it wouldn't hold. But I don't really need, think we need it. And now I will just put them in a shady place because if it's in the sun, uh, the sun might, you know, boil your plants. So you don't want this. Yeah. Go right in the corner. Okay. Perfect. Right? I think it's perfect. Uh, the one thing I will do is I will just squeeze them a little bit more because I know you don't want to go to your hands and stuff. So there's, here's your bag. Try to put it on. I did so, it. Maya, it's our experiment. We never did that. I never propagated any shrubs and I'm very interested to do that. I'm very, very excited. And we'll see. We'll put it in the shady place and see if they give the roots Maya. or they also <laughs> may die. Yay. But that's okay. We just uh, kind of used it for, for, we just used the waste for an experiment, right? we're learning okay thank you for watching i hope uh, uh, we inspired you to go and propagate some shrub yep and we will see you never see you later bye